good morning everyone um, conventional joint replacement surgery is being done since uh, decades and it has given very good results as well but the now is era of accuracy era of precision and era of scientific evolution so the new tool what we have right now with us is mako assisted robotic surgery which can be used for knee replacement hip replacement and uni knee unicondylar knee replacement surgeries as well so the robotic arm do we get many but the mako what we have is first words fda approved robotics it is passive wireless robotic assisted imageless system so here passively wirelessly all the signals are catched through the image which we do pre operatively through ct scan and it is executed on the patient while doing the surgery the doctor when you are doing as a robotic arm assisted surgery is fearless like he knows quantitatively what he is doing manually when he is doing manual cut surgery with jigs you don't know how much he is cutting how much he has to cut here the robo will exactly tell us in millimeters this many mm will help you for cutting this many millimeter of less cutting will help you for balancing so the accuracy and precision is less than a millimeter they say the pain is less the mobility is more and precision and accuracy is good that's why they are so happy it is definitely advantage in tcan because every step is pre operatively planned you know what implants you are using you know how much mm you are cutting you know how much how you are keeping the implant you know precisely how the surgery goes because the planning is done well before the surgery is done so the most important point in tcan is you can balance the knee in a functional way there are different time one is mechanical way whether the patient really wants like that nobody knows you but in robotic you can balance in functional way the more kinematic limited kinematic way so that the patient gets more advantage of the functional alignment so this is a huge advantage in total hip replacement surgery also it helps to put the cup the stabler cup which is a challenge situation three dimensional structure difficult to identify manually how much degrees inclination you have to keep how much degrees antiversion we have to keep and also how we have to calculate the spino pelvic parameters whether it is related to this or not and we also can put the implant with a single rimming not multiple rimming and also it is more advantages to measure the limb length discrepancy which is the most litigated issue in the world the limb will become short or limb will become bigger after the surgery nobody can precisely tell but here with a special parameters measurement parameters we can do that as well so by and large the robotic assisted surgery not only helps in precision it also help for the patient comfort scientific evolution is in such a way that every one can get this benefit so we have this meko which is which will help surgeon and also patient and also the community thank you one